Hey guys, we're going to go ahead and show you how to link information on multiple worksheets in Excel. Um, the most important thing to realize when you're starting this is uh, obviously Excel. You can have as many worksheets as you like. Um, we're going to set it up pretty basic and we're just going to set up uh, the first worksheet as January sales and we're going to use an autocomplete feature on Excel to go ahead and create the days of the month and we're gonna create income or gross rather we'll use gross and we're just gonna say every day we made fifty dollars for instance And 31 days in January. I'm going to total it out. And we'll use our auto sum feature in the top right corner. After you press it, it shows you what it's assuming it wants you want to edit. If it's correct, go ahead and press enter. So 1550 is uh, 50 times 31. Um, and we're going to just copy this sheet. So we're just going to left click and drag and select the whole sheet. We're going to go up to copy, click on that right up here. Go to sheet 2. We're going to paste it. We're going to change January sales to February sales. And we're going to change this 50 number to 75 just for kicks. So it should be 50% higher total. And it's because it's calculation it's already done the math for us and has the new total there. First sheet's total was 1550, this one's 2325. And on the sheet three, we're gonna name this summary of income. And we're gonna have January and February. And what we're gonna do is we're going to click right here where we want the January income to end up. We're going to press enter on the keyboard. We're going to click over to sheet one where January's total is. Click on the total itself. Press enter. Brings it over. Same with February. Equals sheet two. Total. Click on it. Enter. All right, so we have the totals from January and February. And just to test it, um, the reason you do this rather than just type it in is because this keeps it um, relative. So 1550 January, if two of these numbers changed, or any of these numbers changed, the total changes right there. And it also changes here. So if your sales change or whatnot, or you need to change something, it always stays relative to the actual data. Um, and that is linking sheets together in Excel. Have fun, guys.